Hey guys, um, it's Emerald Vox 17 here with a brand new video, and I need to stop saying that now because it's actually getting pretty damn old. Um, good afternoon, and today I have a envelope opening. Um, I believe this has to be the game I ordered like two or three days ago at Amazon Prime, you know said. Um, and also, as you can see, the controller I got, I put it right there. So, um, let's get this opened. As you can see, I typed over the addresses and the, the personal information for kids, just for whatever. So, um, let's open this bitch up. <clears throat> Like there's nothing else. Um, the game I ordered was Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate for the Wii U. They have a 3DS version, but I decided to get Wii U because I'd rather play it on TV than in on DS. And thank God it can use the classic Pro Controller. I do have the Wii U Pro Controller, so either way I'm gonna, you know, good options. Um, I don't think that's new because there's like a piece of cardboard between the layer of plastic and the actual case of the game. That could just be something they left there. Or it's just. I'm seeing stuff. Oh, I'm sorry, I keep looking down. It's made from Capcom. So you know it's a good game, and uh, I can't wait to start playing this. Um, what's the difference between Monster Hunter Try and Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate for the Wii U? Is that. Um, basically the same game except this does have a few more things like a couple new monsters and I think maybe some new gear. It's an updated in HD graphics. Um, I heard the graphics aren't good but I'm playing Xenoblade so I don't really care about graphics personally because Xenoblade is a great game but the graphics kind of lag. Lack. So what I'm so basically what you're trying to do is you're trying to defeat large monsters, collect items, make powerful armor, and do stuff like that. It does have awesome online play, which personally I'm going to go through the game as much as I can by myself, and then I'm going to try it out with other players, redo quests I recently did before. And uh, on the computer, I downloaded the uh, the guide for it because the guides I can't find any physical guide guides online. There is no physical guides for this game, which sucks. And if you guys know where I can get one, let me know. But I found a cool download, a free, a completely free download of the game, of the guide. Um, so I, yeah, it's a 500 page guide. I was thinking, well, you know, if it's like 100, 200 pages, I would probably print it out. No, I'm not printing it out. It's 500 freaking 30 pages. Um, if you don't have this game, check out the demo. There's a demo on the eShop for the Wii U, and it's a pretty good demo. There are two creatures you could fight between. Um, this, like, bunny bear thing, I forgot the name of it, like the Lagoda, I think that's what they call it, and that's easy. The hard mode is this water leviathan creature, and it looks pretty damn cool. Um, also, I got confused. I thought the biggest creature in this game was this large snake that was in Frontier, which is, like, another version of Monster Hunter, I think could be wrong um but no it's something else it's something else altogether Gen is what it's called it's the largest creature in the game um i really can't wait to play this game you could customize your character how you want before you start off the game like skin color type hair color stuff like that it's kind of cool i like that um Monster Hunter 3 for Ultimate for the Wii U i recommend picking it up because i've seen some footage on youtube and uh I played the game demo and I like the game a lot and I can't wait to play it because there's also tons of weapon I options you can pick from. Personally I think I'm gonna use the switch axe because I had the best time using that on the Lagoda. Um its combo is just constant. It's a good combo thing, but I might switch between that and the dual swords. Um so yeah, please check out this game. Um what I'm doing now is that I'm actually going to check if it's a new game because
Okay, this is why I'm disappointed. One, I think this game's already been opened, but not played. And because Nintendo games usually come with the uh, eShop thing, the thing for Club Nintendo. Actually, I, I I think that's only for like real, real mainstream Nintendo games, not just any game. Um, so, yeah, this doesn't have it. I don't think. If it does, if yours did, then I'm kind of disappointed because I don't have mine. With it. So overall, I'm happy with it. The disc looks perfect. It does not look scratched dirty, filthy, or anything, and I hope to God that this wasn't opened before, and I'm going to look it up and see if anyone else has this problem, um, so yeah, and by the way, the piece of cardboard thing right here, that's what I was looking at, it's inside the plastic of the case, so I can't wait to start playing this game, thanks for watching this video, guys, and I hope you kind of enjoyed it, and also, what I normally say during each of my videos, that noise, I think I'm going to start making my videos at night when it's colder because I'm going to do it during the daytime or afternoon. It just my room is really warm and I'd rather do it when it's cooler. So I think the rest of my videos for now is going to be at nighttime and if I have a box opening, I'll just put it away. I'll just put it aside. Like I think I'll clear one of these cubby holes and make that my for later section. So that's all I'm going to say. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.